So what is the snowball effect? Specifically, in Rust, what is snowballing? You might have seen it in H. June's videos, Frost's videos, B. Chill's videos. Well, snowballing is starting off small. Maybe with a bow, maybe a crossbow, and working your way up, one by one, gun by gun, higher tier to higher tier, until you get one of the most powerful in the game. Usually, this is all done in a short amount of time. So today, I'm going to show you my snowball with Ronnie. And this was all recorded in just a few hours. Fifty sulfur or for a bow, that's a deal. I think we should go there, then make a base. Um, maybe in 13 in between meltons and launch site. What is up YouTube, it is Stevie and welcome back to another video. Now, just like season one, Ronnie and I joined a solo duo trio bi-weekly server around four days late and we were looking to get some guns fast, make some plays and have a good wipe in the long run and that's exactly what we did. So stay tuned for future episodes as this wipe gets pretty crazy. I hope you enjoy. This is Stevie and you're watching Vanilla Survival. Are you running? No. Get right here, get right here. DB, hit him twice. Fire errors, he's so hurt. He's dead, he's dead. Run. Headshot him dead. You, you're dead? No, he's dead. Oh shit, nice. He's back, he's naked. Python? Yeah, he's naked with a python. Dumb. He's gonna bleed. He's dead. Nice. What? Okay. I got it. Crashing. Now I didn't take the python out because we planned to stay on the server for a while and I wanted to research it at some point. But when out farming later, I saw the enemy, and more importantly, the gun that would start this wipe snowball. Yo Stevie, are you almost here? Shh, shh, shh. I shot him with the python. Yes, yeah, ammo. Dude. I'm getting sword. Oh, it's two of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you could come, we could drop both these kids. Oh, shit. I might have me caught here. I'm at the base, okay? Tell me when he's close. Is he? He's close. Hit him. Hit him again, he's dead. Nice. He's full of money. Hide, hide, hide. Oh, there's him. Are you dead? Yep. I thought he killed that other kid. He's wide peeking you. You guys fucking cheat. <laughs> you guys fucking cheat. Is that what he said? Are you here? No, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I love when I kill makers and they talk shit. You just wasted 10 metal frags and 5 gunpowder on my ugly ass. Dude, they, they, they kind of had shit, man. Was he metal? Is that right? Yeah, yeah. 
So the snowball began, and this was just the beginning of it. I left the MP5 behind because Ronnie and I wanted to build into our neighbor's base who had been roof camping for the past half hour. Little did we know, this would bring the next step in our snowball. Got solo locks. Yeah. Think I should just hop out with this? No, those guys. Who's outside? Oh, dude! You done? No. Oh, I'm dead. I'm gonna come with the MP5. Okay, is it safe? Let's listen to what he says before he kills Rani. Killed one, four dead. I'm dead. You're dead. Good job, good job. I'm gonna spawn back in. You want me to just run back what I have? Well, I got bolted. Trash talkers and roof campers? Let's just say later, these guys were in for a nasty surprise. Did they see us going here? <laughs> Maybe. Now, I'm sorry I keep stopping it, but it's very important that you guys have some context for this next part. Being four days in the wipe, someone was already giving up and they were offering their base in the chat. Ronnie, with his fast fingers, asked for the base and he immediately got a bag and the codes. Overnight, we transferred everything from that base back to ours. Okay. Come with me. TC. Oh. I see. Come this way. Hop over the bin. Don't trip. Look at all these doors going. Come on. You could take a look around. This is personally my favorite box back here. Oh, nuts, dude. Alright, we need to get this shit in our inventories and gear up quick. Let's fucking blast our ass. Doesn't matter, let's just go. Let's just go. I'm following you, I have no idea where oh, we're this going is. The wrong way. Okay. This way, here we go. I have fucking goggles on my face and shit. Same. Where are you? Soldier, go! Soldier, go! Go, hey, hey. Yeah, we made it. Here we go. Yeah? Oh, they fit. Yeah, like perfectly in that spot, dude. Here, check this, check this box in the center. Oh, garage door. That's what we need. Is someone trying to snag it? Yeah, it's going down, it's down. Okay, come inside. Can you drop me a buckshot? Unprepared. I'm gonna, I'm gonna run back in our base direction. I'm gonna run back in our base direction and see if I can get behind that base so the roof camper doesn't see me and I can get close to their door. There's not a- you gotta go check for a door on the other side. If they kill you, they kill you. I got- He's dead. I got another one coming. He dropped- he jumped on the roof. Fucking dumbass. Let's see what Ronnie was doing at this time. He's dead. I got him too. He jumped on the roof. Fucking dumbass. 
Dude, a bear trap? What? Med, med, med. Triple headshot, dead. Just, just med and, and stay close. Down, okay? Another one dead. Nice. They're gonna, you're gonna put them on timers. Cover it. There's another one. Outside. Dead. AK. I got it. Another one dead. Nice. Grab shit and go. Let's get out of here, dude. Hold up. I got bolt. Alright, let's get out of here, bro. Yep. Let's dip. Hey, Come why on. you close the door? It's so <laughs> hey, we'll drop it on the floor. Drop it on the floor right here. Hold up. Let me save that real quick, B. The hype and the come up were real, and I love Rust. But watch as the AK sinks through the floor to disappear forever. See him down there? Ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Get a, a python. Get a python. Oh my god, dude. Check the bot. The other kid just ran. No way he's still here. You see him? They're running at us. Headshot. Hit hard. Nice. Just run. Just hide. Just hide. Just hide. You're good. Pop the med kit. Medding once. Oh, that went right past. One's down, one's hit. Hit him once. Dead. They had some stuff. I don't know, not that much. Mushies. But Ronnie and I had made too many enemies to stay where we lived. So, in the middle of the night, we moved out pretty far away in between launch site and mill tons, a place loaded with trees and notes, hopefully a good area for PvP as the wipe continued. And even after filling the boxes in our new home, we still had loads of gear back in the old base. So overnight, we prayed that neither of our bases got raided. So that concludes the day's snowball. But being just a few hours in, we weren't the top dogs in the area. We didn't have the most loot. We didn't have the most guns. We didn't have the biggest base. Meet our new enemies, the roof campers, in the next episode. Come on. He's hit. He's hit. He's locked. This is all us. Let's fucking go. Another guy with him in the bushes. Inside. Should I headshot him? Oh, I see three, two, one. Bed. Do we have a ladder?